IDEs are not dead. They are changing. The more you use these terminal-based apps, you realize they actually are quite differentiated subtly on the prompting and on the UI and the ergonomics and all this. They're all getting more and more fancy kind of UI features and configuration features. They're going to bust out of that terminal at some point. It'll still be a terminal. It'll just be a terminal with a lot of kind of UI around it, but it's still fundamentally focused on you talking to that agent and reviewing its work. So it's an IDE, but it's around orchestration and review, not around code creation. And I think the IDEs will probably still have their, a lot of them will still have those sort of coding features for when you want to fall back to them, you know, or whatever. It can, you can be a one-way door, right? If you choose to be inside of an IDE, you may have tied yourself to an IDE that's an anchor, a boat anchor. Yeah. If you tie yourself to a particular uh, model, you got to be real careful which model you tie yourself to. Um, you can make a lot of decisions that seem really good. And then six months later, everything just turns upside down. Roll with the changes because boy, oh boy, things are changing so fast.